General Melton will be here at any moment. When he arrives, leave the talking to me, all right? I like to keep an informal trench, as you know, but today you must only speak with my express permission. Is that clear? Is that clear? <laughs> permission to speak. Yes, yes sir. Uh, absolutely, uh, yes. <laughs> Excellent. At ease. Now then, Blackadder, where would you like me to sit? I thought just a simple trim of the moustache today, nothing drastic. Yes, no, sir. We hear about the paintings. Oh, yes, of course. Good Lord, George! <laughs> how are you, my boy? <laughs> I said, how are you? Permission to speak. Oh, absolutely top holes are with a yin and a yang and a yippity do. <laughs> Splendid! Um, your Uncle Betty sends his regards. I told them you could have a week off in April. Don't want you missing the boat race, do we? Permission to speak? Oh, certainly not. <laughs> Permission to sing boisterously, sir. If you must. <laughs> row, row, row your punch gently, gently down, down the stream. <laughs> Belts off, trousers down, is a life a scream. <laughs> <laughs> Fabulous. University education. You can't beat it. Can you? <laughs> now, now, what have we here? Name? Permission to speak. Paul Drake, sir. Go oh, telly ho, yibbity dap and zing zang spillet. Looking forward to bullying off for the final chucker? Permission to speak. <laughs> answer the general, Baldrick. I can't answer him, sir. I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> Uh, are you looking forward to the big push? No, sir, I'm absolutely terrified. <laughs> the healthy humour of the honest Tommy. <laughs> Don't worry, my boy. If you should falter, remember that Captain Darling and I are behind you. About 35 miles behind you. <laughs> 